What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Trading Crypto. Today, we're over XTC Network, which is up 17.4% today at 7.4 cents. So this thing's been on an absolute tear the last week or last couple of days. And pretty much the only coin uh, that's up right now, I mean, if we go to CoinGecko and in the top 100s, look, it's all red. It's all red. And then there's XTC right here, 17.4. Also, Casper is up. 13.5 but that is a different video so we're gonna be going into xtc so with that let's get into the price prediction and technical analysis on xtc network all right all right all right xdc network day chart so as of the day chart right now look at this awesome rounded bottom that we formed here for xdc pretty much moved sideways since july of 2022 just consolidation 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 accumulation until we finally lifted off we actually broke above a very critical horizontal resistance area for xdc as well right here that 675 was a mega resistance area for xdc you can see we wicked to it once and then we broke blasted right through it so the next main resistance area that i'm seeing here isn't until eight cents so we're kind of in no man's land right here i mean we could draw a lifelong fib and maybe hit a fib let's see uh, top to bottom right here. If we go top to bottom, we actually just broke above the 236. Next resistance area, it says here's so a 382 at 9 cents. So XTC right now, I would have to say it's bullish. I mean, is it starting as bull run? We'll have to wait and see. We clear this up and we just go to the indicators real quick on the short term time frame. Let's see what's going on here. We were heading down bearish here, losing our bullish momentum. But guess what? We had a fake out. Fake out a huge engulfing candle on today's chart rsi briefly overbought we are pretty high in the rsi so take that into consideration we're at 77 we did get a sell signal yesterday on the wtx but if we were to listen to that we would have missed this pump that we got today so xtc bullish right now let's go to the four hour time frame and see what's happening in the short term short term time frame look how many sell signals we had and we continued higher down there we were overbought on the rsi but as of right now it doesn't look like we're stopping. It looks like we've gained some momentum here. The train is moving. We have, we are very, very bullish here on the MACD, not even showing any signs of slowing down in the four hour. Our size overbought, but this thing can go overbought and stay overbought for quite a while. And as you can see, you can print multiple sell signals and still maintain your upward momentum. So short term right now, let's see what's happening with the fibs top to bottom right here. Next stop, what I was saying is around that eight to nine cents area. So that, that one, two, three, six area, I would be keeping a close eye on eight cents for the next stop between eight and nine cents, I believe is going to be the next stop. I'm going to draw a box. I'm going to draw a rectangle box at nine cents all the way down to eight cents. And this is going to be the, the, the go-to area. This is going to be the heavy resistance area for XDC. If we get through this box, then we're going to be off to the races here. And this thing's going to start i guess you can kind of say it's starting as bull run right now if we get over this that's only going to confirm it so i'd be keeping an eye on eight cents for the next stop that's where you're going to start hitting some resistance and then you'll be battling resistance between eight and nine cents get over nine cents then it's off to ten uh and then to infinity and beyond so congrats on people who held xdc for the extended period of time i know how much it sucks when your coin doesn't move and you just have you held this entire accumulation phase it definitely paid off because look at how awesome this rounded bottom is right here that is a beautiful, beautiful rounded bottom. <laughs> so with that, none of this is financial advice. And if there's any coins you'd like me to chart, or if you just like to chat with me, you can post them on my Discord or on my Twitter page. The links are below in the description.